The second day of Royal Ascot. King Charles and Queen Camilla arrive in style on a horse-drawn carriage, accompanied by their niece Zara Tyndall. The trio joined other members of the royal family, including Prince Edward, Princess Michael of Kent, and Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh, for a day at the races. As they made their way up to the royal box, the sun was shining and the atmosphere was electric. The king and queen stood on the balcony, watching as the revelers in their finery enjoyed the day's events. Camilla was particularly happy as she presented the trophy for the Prince of Wales Stakes, a race that she has long been a fan of. The Duchess of Edinburgh also looked stunning in her crisp white outfit, complete with a large brimmed hat. But it wasn't just the royals who looked fabulous. Zara Tyndall, an accomplished equestrian herself, and her rugby player husband Mike were also in attendance. Zara opted for a chic navy blue outfit and a green hat to complete the look. Princess Anne's daughter, an Olympic silver medal-winning equestrian, and her former rugby player husband shared the intimate moment as they took part in the traditional royal procession this afternoon. Zara looked stunning in a dark eggplant dress from Laura Green, matched with a bespoke teal fascinator from Juliet Botterill, her blonde locks neatly pinned back into a low bun. As the pair arrived, they were joined by other royals including the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh and King Charles and Queen Camilla. Sophie, Duchess of Edinburgh, also stood out in a stunning white silk frock. The dress featured bow detailing and buttons down the front, and was from designer Susanna, costing an impressive £3,450. It was a fantastic day at Royal Ascot, with everyone dressed to impress and enjoying all that the festival has to offer. This year, organisers of the race have paid tribute to Royal Ascot's biggest fan, Queen Elizabeth II, who passed away last September. During her 70-year reign, her late majesty attended almost every single Royal Ascot festival, with the exception of last year.